Americans talk differently anyway. This is a termite. <laughs> Americans talk differently. That's why I've always felt that as far as intelligence is concerned, when you go to Europe or someplace like that, please do not feel inferior to those people because they can speak 11 different languages. <laughs> the reason why they can speak 11 different languages, mostly, is because sometimes it's only a half hour drive or a two hour drive to go from one language to another. All over Europe, you can do the same thing. Now in the United States, you can drive for eight days and not run into another language, <laughs> you see? So don't feel inferior. I mean, I feel very intelligent myself, mainly because of the scores I made on the exam. But aside from that, I mean, I can speak Cleveland. I can speak Houston. Bye! You know? I can, I can you, you take an Englishman who's supposed to be very intelligent. See, English people speak the way they do because the suits they wear don't bend too good. And they have to stand up straight, you know, and... You see, their bottom lip is not as developed as ours. You see, their bottom lip so I say, yeah, what the fuck is this? You say, oh boy, you piss it. See, you have to talk like that if you have to say, oh, what the fuck is this? See, they're not as relaxed. They all sit up straight no matter what. You've never seen an Englishman leaning unless he was dying. And even then he's saying, I'm so embarrassed that I'm leaning here, yeah, but it seems that my life's leaving me, you'll see. <laughs> English people are conceited. You ever hear them? They love to listen to themselves. They say everything twice. Here, yeah, here. Yeah. <laughs> I went to a party and this Englishman kept saying, I say, I say, and then he didn't say nothing. <laughs> And a friend with him kept saying, quite so, quite so. Said, quite so what, man? What are you two talking about? Don't speak to him, Charles. There's a heathen. Heathen, heathen. I'd be a heathen, Jack. I'd take them two dudes to Mississippi. They wouldn't be able to understand a dude from Mississippi. See, I can understand Mississippi. You take an Englishman to Mississippi, the Mississippi dudes would say, hey, y'all, come on over here. I beg your pardon. <laughs> so I'm talking to y'all. Y'all come on over here. You here? <laughs> Who? All y'all. <laughs> you speaking of some sort of margarine? <laughs> no, all y'all come on over here. Right now. <laughs> See, he wouldn't understand that. People from New Jersey saw things. I saw a dog. <laughs> What, in half? No, I saw him. He was here. <laughs> you go to New England, man can die from a hat attack. <laughs> you know, my Uncle Walter died from a hat attack. You mean some hats jumped on him and beat him up? No, his hat attacked him, his hat. <laughs> 